good morning students welcome back to the digital learning english class at san joseph english medium school vijaypur dear students in our previous video we have learned about poem fourth books and analysis that poem and learned some hard hard words so today in this video we are going to solve some exercises of this poem let's solve the exercises in ex in this exercises the first main question is match the words with their meanings write the answers what you have to do they have given two columns one is word column another one is meaning column so you have to match the words with their correct meaning and write the answers in the answer column let's do children first one knights knights meaning answer is an armed soldier of high rank second one gnome gnome meaning is dwarf dwarf means a small person third one quaint quaint meaning is old fashioned called meaning is old fashioned hearty hearty meaning of the hearty is cheerful answer column we have to write cheerful then fifth one adventure adventure its meaning exciting journey exciting journey so this complete main question match the following now the second main question is fill in the blank select the fill in the blanks select the correct alternative and fill in the blanks you have to select the correct word from the brackets and and fill in the blanks first one the poet loves his dash which one the correct answer fairies knights books books is the correct answer the poet loves his books second one each book is like a dash street town city narrow which one is correct city each book is like a city street third one each time the poet reads he visits a dash wonderland wonderland thunderland which one is correct wonderland which one is correct wonderland not wonderland and thunderland wonderland is a correct answer each time the poet reads he visit a wonderland fourth one the poet goes adventuring with his dash friends the poet goes adventuring with his old and new friends old and new friends this is the correct answers so let's move to the third main question answer the following questions answer the following questions first question is what does the poet feel about his books answer is the poet feels that each book is like a city street and he meets new and old friends along its winding ways once again answer the poet feels that each book is like a city street and he meets new and old friends along its winding ways second question to whom are the books homes to whom are the books homes answer is the books are the homes of queens fairies knights and gnomes the books are the homes of queens fairies knights and gnomes third question why does the poet feel that each time he reads he makes a call third question is why does the poet feel that each time he reads he makes a call answer is each time he reads the book he feels that someone welcomes him and leads him through his wonderland each time he reads the book he feels that someone 
welcomes him and leads him through his wonderland now the question answers are completed next one activity next one activity language development in this the first one is read loud each words remember the letter in silent what we have to do we have to read the words given below the below in the columns we have to read the words and we should learn which letter is the silent letter in that word okay let's read a silent letter cannot be heard but it can be seen when we write the word it does not change the other sounds in the word the silent letter cannot be heard but we 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 have to use that letter in the word but it can be seen when we write the word it does not change the other sounds in the word it does not change any sounds in the word okay let's read the words let's read the words almond first one almond almond l is not sounding in this word in this word l is a silent letter l is not sounding almond so second word wednesday wednesday in this word d is a silent letter we are not sounding wednesday d is not sounding in this word so d is a silent letter in this word third one wrinkle 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 w is not sounding so w is a silent letter fourth one handsome handsome hand some so d is not sounding so d is a silent letter in this word next one scratch scratch in this scratch word t is not sounding so scratch t is a silent letter so next row next line depth depth in this word b is silent b is not sounding here so b is a silent letter in this word next hole 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 here w is not sounding means w is a silent letter in this word next one knife knife k is not sounding in this word so k is a silent letter in this word knife next one neck neck here also k is not sounding so the k letter is a silent in this word last one th- knuckle knuckle in this knuckle in this word k is also not sounding so the k is silent letter next row chalk 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 in this word l is not sounding l is not sounding so the l is a silent letter in this word next next passion passion in this word t is not sounding so the t is a silent letter next one ghost 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 so in this word h is silent letter next num 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 the last letter b is silent in this word guard 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 word u is a silent letter it is not sounding means u is a silent letter next row butcher butcher in this word t is a silent letter so next one sword sword in this word w is a silent letter then design design in design word g is silent letter comb comb in this word b is a silent letter last one plumber plumber in this word l is a silent letter l is silent letter next guest guest in guest u is a silent letter u is a silent letter often 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 in this word t is a silent letter next castle castle in this word t is a silent letter t is a silent letter last night night in night k and g both are the silent letters 
in night k and g are the silent letter the, the those words are not sounding in this so the last row not 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 in this first letter g is the silent letter first letter g is the silent letter next now 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 means g is the silent letter nash nash g here also the g is a silent letter no no g is a silent letter so dear children these are the words having a silent letters you should read these words properly amand wensade wrinkle handsome scratch depth hole knife knock knuckle chalk fasten ghost numb guard butcher sword design comb plumber guest often castle night not no nash no next activity read and remember you have to read this and remember we are going to learn now homophones or homonyms what is the homophones many words in english have same sounds many words in english sound the same but the words with the different spellings but same sound are called homophones or homonyms what is homony homonyms or homophones what are the homophones many words in english sound same the words with the different spellings but the same sound are called homophones for examples sun sun in both sun pronounce same sun sun but the sun meaning is maga s o n sun means maga second one s u n sun means surya so like this having different spellings same pronounced word is called homophones or homonyms homophones or homonyms have a different meanings but the different meanings different spellings they have but the sounds are same next let's solve the exercise on the homophones read the pairs of homophones given in the brackets fill in the blanks with the correct word to make meaningful sentence what we have to do read the pair of homophones given in the brackets fill in the blanks with the correct words to make a meaningful sentences let's do first one a we are and we are and dash away from dash house house our our so what we have to fill here our our both sound same but which our we are and our how h o u r our away from the away from our house away from our o u r our house second one i can dash the dash from the window of my house here c c both having same sounds but the meanings are different i can see s e w e c i can see the c s e a c ocean s e a c c from the window of my house third one c my mother curved a dash from with dash here we have two options like floor floor my mother curved a flower flower f l o w e r flower means who flower from the weight floor floor means hit floor means hit floor my mother curved a flower the weight floor fourth one d the brown hair has a soft hair here we have filled both hair hair sounds there so one h a r e hair means mola rabbit second one h a i r hair means kudalu okay the brown hair has a soft hair last one e one ami read the story book of the knights at the night 
Amy read the story book of the knights at the night. Knights means an armed soldier who worked, who worked for the, who fought for the, who fight for the king. Knight is a soldier, an armed soldier of a high rank. So another night means Ratri. Amy read the story book of nights at night. This completes your activity. Dear students, now we have completed exercise, all exercises of the poem books. So last one is a speaking skill. You have to recite the poem of the books. You have to recite this poem books in your home. And you have to write all these exercises, new words in your English classwork and homework neatly. Thank you.